Hi Lords! This is the first time saying hello as Dragon Seas. Starting today, once you log into the game, you will see the Dragon Seas name and logo. With the fresh new name, we promise to provide you with an enhanced experience moving forward. Alright then, now allow me to summarize the new update, including the new knight Luna and the new missing soldier system. Let me introduce to you Luna, the shadow elf that embraces the moon's madness. Luna has the skill to silence enemies around her for 3 seconds. If you want to defend Dragonia with Luna, visit the pub now. A storybook containing the history of Dragonia will finally be released. You can use the items obtained after completing the field entry event mission to unlock each story. There is also a reward for unlocking each story, so don't forget to collect those rewards. The stamina that was applied to the Lord will be removed, and individual stamina will be applied to all knights. Now you must plan your undead hunts more efficiently. A system has been added to reduce the burden of soldier losses. Immediate soldier losses after PvP battles will remain the same as before. However, from now on, a partial will show up as missing soldiers. But don't worry, after a certain period of time, these soldiers will return to the village and rejoin your troops. The various materials that were used for building upgrades and crafts have been simplified. The smelting, crafting, and processing stones will be removed, and gems will now replace their roles. Also, construction and training resources have changed to require construction kits and training kits respectively. Now take your time and manage your village without any complications. A new recipe to craft Knight XP has been added. The new recipe can only be crafted in the Merge server. Use this new recipe to grow your knights at a super fast rate. Looks like the residents of the village want to give back to their lords. I hear the civil request rewards will now be bigger and better. So I'd handle those requests if I were you. And that's all for today's update. In addition, Contents not included in the video, such as various UI improvements, can be found in the patch note. I'll leave a link at the bottom of the video. See you next time! Bye!